Yo, what's happening guys? Welcome back to another episode of Stone Block 3. If you guys have missed out on any, be sure to check out that playlist and get caught up on the, those you've not yet seen. Make sure you hit that like down below. If you enjoy, helps out a bunch. Subscribe to the channel, turn on the notifications. Don't miss out on all the future videos and streams. Well, let's get right into it. So, what I was working on last time, I was working on Ars Nouveau. And uh, we need the Arch uh, Mage Spellbook. But, I'm missing one thing. The Totem of Undying. I wish I could do it this way. This would be way easier, but <laughs> I don't think that works. So we need a Totem of Undying. So I think I need to get into the Nether. By the way, it's been a little bit since I've played on here, so uh, I'm forgetting a lot of things. <laughs> but yeah, I think in the Nether, you can spawn the... Um, there was an area where I died a lot, and there spawns the... Uh, whatever the heck they're called. Evokers. Evokers. Yeah, that's what it is. And so, I need to get back in there and fight them, but I think I'm not going to do that right meow. I think we're going to work on... Oh, we have to go beyond the end ring to get to the boss dungeon. Oh, fudge. That's going to be wild. Oh, so I need to take some quartz and melt up some quartz into some silicon, and then uh, we can uh, we can actually start towards this stuff, I think. Towards the ME stuff, which I really need to do. We need engineer processor, and for that we need printed silicone, and... Oh, do we need like a line of these? Hmm, I wonder. I wonder if I can do it with my one. Let's make some silicone first of all and uh, see what happens. I'm just going to smelt up a whole lot of it. All right, we got one. So let's go test this out. I believe it just goes here, right? Is it going to do? Oh, it doesn't look like it's doing stuff. Uh-oh. Huh. WT fudge. Oh, I need the uh, the press. That's what it is. Iron and silicone. Okay. So I think what I need to do, hopefully this work, is grab an iron block. And do we put this here? That didn't work. Put that there. And then we hand this to you. Oh, it did it. I got the iron block back, too. Okay, we got the inscriber. Did I already have one? Did I already do that? I already did that. Oh, I made a silicone press. Before I had this press, now I have this press. Okay, so now we can take some of that silicone, I think. Oh, having storage system, gonna be so nice. And then we can pop that down there. And then I think we can pop this in here. Come on. Do you not want this? Oh, wait. It's gonna do? Or no? It's not doing. What in the name of butts? Oh, I see. I was doing it backwards. You have to have this. There we go. And then you can go there. I should just make all of them. Hey, there we go. Yo, 12 of these. Okay, nice. Very nice. And then, uh, what was next? Oh, I need to keep checking on this. I'm growing more of this stuff. Should tell me the percentage, right? That's not done, is it? I don't want to pick it up too early. Because that'll ruin it. Oh, no, it's still seed. 99 point... Or 92.99. Come on. Grow up. I have four of them here. Okay, what was next? So, it shows the three... Step three process. So, it shows it, like, a three-step process, but do I have to actually, like... Put them in a in a conveyor or something or like let's see what happens with with this one i don't know okay so maybe what we do do we take this and do we put redstone on it is that what I'm, is that what i'm getting from this give me that back oh does that need uh does it need some kind of uh inscriber on it inscribing engineering press okay so we need that that's a diamond and iron okay we can do that easy enough so is it the iron down here and then a diamond up here. There we go. Easy peasy. Lemony squeezy jibs. Then a diamond with this makes this. Okay. Oh, wait. Did those grow? They grew. Frig yeah. Do I have enough to make the thing yet? Okay, we have eight. I think that's enough to make the thing I need. But we're, we're, we're working on this now. So we'll, we'll worry about that in a little bit. So you get that. And you get that. And you give me that. And I take that back. No, I want... Give me things. Keep all my uh, presses in, in order here. Okay, so I think what it is... 
We're gonna take the diamond one and we're gonna put the silicone and then we're gonna put the redstone on it. I don't know if it needs to go in the line like that, but we're gonna try this out. We'll put this here. We'll put this here. Okay, it did that. And then we put redstone. And then we need a press too, don't we? It's like, what is it showing here? Let's see if I, do I have that? I feel like I have that already, don't I? Yeah, mechanical press. Okay, so now what happens if I go like this? And put this in. Yeah, there we go. We got it. That wasn't too bad. Skystone. I was making that, wasn't I? Didn't that go in here? Or here? Okay, we have Skystone. Yo, we're making some progress right off the rip. Heck yeah. But here's the problem. We're going to have to delay progress because... I need to make the budding fluix. I need eight of these to make the budding fluix. What the fudge monkeys? Get out of here, you dumb idiots. Gee, dang it. Slimes have become my worst enemies. I'm sorry, Captain Sparkles, but these slimes... I think you would understand. Gee, dang it. I don't know. Is it... You know what? Here's what I'm thinking. I take two of these, right? And I throw them into here. There we go. And then we can make another couple seeds. And uh, we could use four of these. Yeah, I'll, I'll do that. Because, like, this way that I'm doing it is still duplicating it, right? So, actually, let's throw... I only need four of these. So let's throw two more into here. Let's get a, quite a few seeds going. There, we, we can make... Uh, that's going to be, like, what, eight seeds? Isn't it that and sand? We'll find out, won't we? Yeah, fluid seeds. So yeah, that's eight seeds, so that's going to be enough to make the budding crystal, and I also will have enough now to make the thing that I'm trying to make. Yeah, I'll have enough to make the ME controller. There we go, ME controller. Come on. I have the sky stone. It's right there. Alright, maybe I have to do this one manually. What the butts? Skystone block. Skystone. What the heck have I done wrong? Okay, so you take this in here. Wait, what? Oh, it has to be smelted? I see. I see, I see. Was very confused because I thought I had all that stuff. There we go. Now we have it. So... We can go back to this. Now we have the ME controller. Frig yeah. And a sight casing. Fantastic. I really, I really appreciate that. That is so useful. Fan freaking tastic. The best. Best uh, thing I've ever received. Okay, so with that, then. We need to make drives. We need to make a security terminal. Oh, we need the, the storage units now, too. Okay, so we need even more engineer processors, and we need the storage units. So what I think I'm going to do, I think I am going to leave the press here, and then I'm going to expand this out and put the uh, the hand, the deployer in, and another depot. Hey, those, those andesite casings are actually coming in handy. Imagine that. Yeah, this running back and forth is butts. I'm, I'm, uh, I can't wait. To have the the storage system. It's going to be so nice. Bam. We have another depot. I'm probably going to need a bunch more gears. Hopefully we can put that there. I'm thinking that'll work if I run a gear off of this. And then three. Alright. So hopefully this works. There we go. Oh, it actually can go right next to it, I think. Oh, no. That's not that's not right. That's not where I want it. I want it off of this one. Kind of butts trying to go off of the big one. You need a little one to go off a big one. And then a big one off a little one. But there we go. That should work. I just need uh, one more cog. Actually, I don't because the depot doesn't need to be powered, does it? If I put this here, this should just work. Wrong way. There we go. Yeah, that should work. Nice. So now we have a press and uh, a hand. This area over here has just become a complete freaking mess. I'm not sure why we're getting ash. Oh no, it's clay. Why do I have clay here? 
Oh, the Enderman. That dingus. All right, so now we need the security. I need to make another one of these. So luckily that's easy enough. I can just do this. Oh, I need to make one of these though. So I need diamonds. Let me just grab like a stack of diamonds and put them in this chest too. I'm trying to make it so I don't have to run like all over the place. Grab all my presses. So we need the engineer press. Okay. So let's give you that. Take it. And then let's put a uh, diamond down here. Okay, we have that. Then we need to put silicone, redstone, and press it. Okay. So we're going to put this down here. We're going to do silicone. Uh, oh, fudge. I hope I didn't fudge it. Grab like I'm going to grab like a stack of redstone too because that's coming in handy with this stuff. Or two. Two stacks. It just automatically gives me two stacks for whatever reason. Then if we do that, we only need one of these. Bam. Okay. And then we just need to press it, right? So if I take it and put it over here, press, bam, engineer processor. Oh, I need Fluix. Okay. I do need to get Fluix going like crazy. Quartz fiber, certus quartz, and glass. It has to be this type of Fluix cable, huh? I wonder, do I have any of that? Have I gotten any of that from uh, from a quest? What is it called? Fluix ME glass. Okay, let's check. Because I've gotten so many different rewards, you know, you never know if maybe I just have it sitting here. It looks like I do not. Ooh, those look almost grown. That's not done yet. Not done yet. Okay. But I do have plenty of it. Okay, so I need some glass. Do I have a glass chicken or is that even a thing? Oh, it is a thing. <laughs> I was kind of like questioning myself, but yeah, that's the thing. Uh, how much do I... I need a lot more glass than that, don't I? I need like... Yeah, I need six glass at least. I wonder why... It's so weird. Sometimes it's just automatically... It's like, here's two. Other times it's like, okay, here's the normal amount. There it is. Shabam. Do I need more of it than that, though? No, I only need two. But this... Oh, I need to make an ME chest. Oh, fudge. Okay, so I do need more of that. I might as well make more of that. Let's see about what other stuff I can get going while that is uh, cooking up. ME drive. I can maybe start the drive. Hmm, I do need... Yeah, I do need another engineering processor. So let's go ahead and make that. Bam. We have the first step. Then uh, we put silicone and then redstone and then press it, right? Let's see. Let's see if I'm right on this. Silicone. Redstone. Press. Yeah. I'm getting the handle of it now. Okay, so the only thing I'm still missing is the uh, Fluix glass cable. So what I'm waiting on is my Fluix to grow up. Let's see where we're at. Oh, we're almost there. So waiting on that to grow up, and then I can make the budding one, and then we can get it automated. Let me clear out a little bit of a space here for that. Yeah, we'll put that right here next to that one. Oh, this is real easy. Uh, I can start into the blood magic stuff. Uh, I'm already, like, partway there. I have the sacrificial knife. Oh, wait, that grew up. Okay, there we go. Never mind. Maybe we'll do that another time. <laughs> I'm all over the place. But actually, we're going to make this, and we're going to have to wait for this to grow. This takes a minute to grow and stuff, so we'll put this down over here next to this one, and we'll let it grow. Actually, I think I need to give it a little more space, don't I? Actually, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to extend out this way. Put that there, and that should start growing, hopefully. It's got a block on each side. Maybe I should give it a little more space, even. Should I give this one more space, too? There we go. Should I go down one more even? All right. Well, hopefully that hopefully that works out. We are going to need to let that grow, though. So I might as well. I could start on blood magic. Holy schmoly. I got too many things going right now. <laughs> Way too many things going. I have no idea where I'm even at. All right. So I think I have everything I need. I need... Uh, yeah. I think that should be it. You need stone, a furnace, and gold. And we have a blood altar. Bam. Oh, I got the Sanguine Scientium. I'm nervous about that. A lot of stuff isn't implemented, so please excuse our dust. Click here to get started. If you find these bugs, please report to GitHub. The Blood Altar. We have that. Okay. Central block of the mod. 
able to convert raw blood into pure life essence. Well, it may start off small and insignificant in strength and size, grow throughout this mod, acting as a cornerstone for most of your power. Okay. Tiers of Slate. Blood Altar's main use is the production of slates. Each of the tier requires a previous tier, more powerful altar than the last. Note the ethereal slates aren't currently implemented. Oh. But maybe if you're playing in a mod pack, check JEI for details. Oh, okay, I see. So we're taking stone on the blood altar and making blank slate. Blank slate to make a reinforced slate. And then we can reinforce to imbued. Okay. So I think the gist of it, let's go make an area. Are we budding? Are we butting yet? Come on, crystal bud. Whoa, he mad. He mad. Why he mad? Stop. Stop. You can't believe you've done this. So this is like beginning to be the magic area. So I'm going to expand out a little bit more here. I'm not sure how much room I need for this, but we're going to make a big area. I'm assuming it's a big area that we need. I have seen a little bit of it. And it looks like I think you have to make like a big altar thing eventually. Yeah, we'll just clear out some of this. And this shall be the magic zone. Alrighty, so I have the altar area. Uh, I'm sticking with this gray magic-y wood. Uh, it just kind of matches the stone though, so, you know, it is what it is. But let's go ahead and plop this down here in the middle. I think I need my sacrificial knife. Hey, look at that. We have growth. We got a ways to wait though. I think it has to be the large. I don't know, it might even have to go farther than that. Uh, sacrificial knife. Nice. Okay. That was easy enough to spot. I was like, oh man, how am I going to find this thing? <laughs> but it was easy. And then what do we do? Something here. Aha. Yes. I hurt myself and fill this up. Oh, okay. So I was like, where's it going? Wait, no, it is going somewhere. Where's it going? Why is it drain away? I don't like that. Why is it draining away? That's butts. Okay. So I need to like quickly try and make this thing then. So, the uh, Tears of Slate. I need to put any kind of stone in there. I think I see. I think what you got to do, what you want to do, is you put the stone in, and then you do the blood thing, and then it makes it. I'll just make a few of these. Oh, wait. It's doing. Hey, it did it. All right, sweet. I have a blank slate. That should be another quest. All right, bam. More Handicite casings. Thanks for that. Oh, to make it tier two, we need to make eight runes. So we make a blank rune. Weak blood shard. Gold. Okay, gold on the blood altar. All right, so let's throw a, a gold block on the blood altar, and then we stab myself a lot until it does stuff. Come on. Do stuff. Does it need more? Why doesn't it seem to be working? Yeah, it's showing tier one, right? Oh, that's tier three. Okay, I have to do a diamond. Why is gold higher tier than... That makes no sense. Why would gold be higher tier than diamond? Gold is butts. But this should work. If I pop this on there. Bam. Yeah, there we go. Now it's doing stuff. Hey, there we go. Shabam. Is that another one? Done? Or no? Oh, it is. Blood Orb. Bam. Shabam. We got an enchanted book. Oh, Silk Touch. Actually, kind of might be kind of handy. All right. So what was I looking to do here? I'm trying to make this. So we need a little bit more stone, the orb, and the blank rune. I should have... Oh, yeah. I should have all of it. Let's go. Blank rune. Oh, I need one more stone. Uh, what am I missing? There we go. Blank rune. I need eight of them, though. Yeah, it wants eight. <laughs> oh, boy. That's going to be quite butts. Oh, and it doesn't even use that, though. Oh, okay. So, really, I just need to make seven more of these. This is going to take a lot of blood. I'm going to, like, bleed out trying to make this freaking thing happen. <laughs> what the heckle? Except for, actually, no, It's it seems like it's holding on to my life essence now. Bam. Everything needs like an empty hand to be able to, to work on this stuff. I'm going to need a golden apple. They're easy enough to make, and that's going to help me do this faster, I think. It's going to give me that regen, that good regen. 
Oh, I gotta wait. I gotta wait a little bit. I gotta let myself regen up because I'm just like keep drawing my health all the way down. So, but we are almost there. One more. Come on, we can do this. Let my health regen up a little bit again, and we'll we'll keep going. Is it gonna be enough? Come on. Not enough. Come on, it's gotta be enough. It's gotta be enough. Look at it's all my blood. Nice, it was enough. Frig yeah. Okay, now we should be able to finish this up. What I'm actually gonna do, because I think I'm running short on regular like stone, I'm gonna I'm gonna smelt up a little bit of stone. Oh, I have a whole stack of chicken here. Imagine that. Uh, we'll we'll grab a bit of this. Enough to make a little bit of this stuff. There's two. There's three. Oh, we're almost there. All right, we only need enough for two more. Yeah, two more. Let's go. Bam, only need enough for one more. Come on, smelt it up. There it is. That's it. I like that the blood orb is um, reusable. There, that's it. Another quest you do done. Holy crap, I'm getting more more stuff. I just don't know what to do with all this stuff. I need this freaking ME system. Every time I'm like, I'm getting closer to the ME system, but I'm really not. <laughs> I just am struggling so bad. Actually, we, we are getting closer because now I have these producing. Um, I'm kind of scared to break that because I don't know if that's fully done. And this, I know for a fact this ain't done. Probably what I'm going to have to do is just kind of AFK and let these grow. I think taking that bottom layer out is making this grow now, though. So that seems good. Should I... Yeah, I have the large ones. I'm going to try and break them and see. Nope, it just disappears. It wasn't done. It wasn't done. Fudge, what have I done? Okay, so for the apprentice, you need a blood altar tier 2. How do I make the blood altar tier 2? Let me check my fancy dancy book here. Oh, I see. Okay, this is kind of what I was thinking, but I know how it works. So what you got to do, because it, it did make me make these. So this is this is what I was thinking, and this this is what you actually have to do. You break this, and you're going to take these eight, and you're going to place them like that. Then I need to put something down there. And you put it on top. And that should be tier two, I'm thinking. And to make this next, the apprentice orb, we need a uh, redstone, and we're going to fill it up with blood. So let's try this. Redstone block. Get out of here, egg. Uh, we put this here, and we're going to go like this. Oh, yeah, look, it's working. It actually is working. You can tell by the way it is. Gapple up. Ah, it's out of blood. Dang it, it's taking it too fast. How do I keep up with this thing? Oh, I, I just died. <laughs> <laughs> oh gee dang it my soul became too weak oh good god man you hate to see it let's try that again and this time better how much blood does this sucker need 5,000 life points can I even produce that much can I even fill this up that much is it saving the amount that I've already put in I wonder I wonder if it's not even saving what I've been putting in I wonder if this is something I should like take this out fill it up okay so it's holding on to it i'm just gonna have to take my time and fill this thing up after i heal ah here we go this is what it's like it's a certus quartz cluster and that means it's done i should have known and then that just gives you straight up certus quartz so the other one should do the same so i've actually like just by kind of afking and gathering i think i've gotten a lot of certus quartz yeah look at that look at all that certus quartz so hopefully i can do the same with the other yeah, hopefully I can just chill here, let it grow, gather it, get a bunch. I'm talking a bunch. Halfway there. I kind of just want to finish this up before I go. I've done a lot of progress today, though. Actually getting that done, getting some more of this stuff going. Could even extend this out one more time. That's going to kind of start running into this. Actually, it should be fine. Yeah, I could even add another bit of one of these. Kind of speed up the process even more. I'm getting close on storage. Oh, wait, I did an industrial foregoing. Didn't even realize. Chiseled block. Automatically restock and store bits. Hmm. Interesting. Don't know what I'm going to use that for. But yeah, check it out. My uh, storage, I'm actually getting close. I'm actually getting close. Dang, you freaking slimes. I hate you so much. You are butts. You are butts. You're all butts. 
Worst things ever invented. Why can you spawn in the light? No other things can do that. All right, let's go. Oh, we're almost freaking there. We're so close. I got it. Here we go. Go on. Do the stuff. Hey, we did it. Look at it. We got the thing. Questy do done. Bam. I keep getting these advanced item collectors. I need to learn what to actually do with them. Alrighty, well anyways guys, that just about does it for today's episode of Stone Block 3. I hope that you enjoyed. If you did, make sure you hit that like button down below. Subscribe to the channel and turn on those notifications so you don't miss out on the future streams or videos. Join the Discord, come by and chat. Also, if you want to help support the channel, all you gotta do is drop 99 cents a month only 99 cents and you can become a member and you get a bunch of cool perks such as access to a 24 7 cross-platform vanilla minecraft server you can join when you want or with me on fridays around 7 30 a.m eastern time you get a bunch of other cool stuff like emojis in the chat emojis you can use or emojis that show you what level you are priority comment replies access to the member only content such as the special beard pics all that good stuff but anyways thank you guys again for watching hopefully we'll see you in the next one peace